Aggressive bear behavior forced the shutdown of the Lacan backcountry shelter in the Great Smoky Mountains. Rangers cited a series of cases of young bears trying to get inside in search of food and garbage. The closing is temporary, done out of caution. We often see bears foraging for food in the fall, but that bear behavior in the backcountry was termed aggressive. And 10 News reporter Amelia Young joins us to explain what that means. Amelia? John, for almost two weeks, the Lacan Backcountry Shelter has been dealing with these cases. Not all bears are aggressive, but they are unpredictable, and it's important to know what to look out for before you head to the park. Well, I think number one, just having awareness of your surroundings. Hiking, camping, or just driving through, there's a good chance you'll spot a bear in the Great Smoky Mountains this time of year. While the closing of the Lacan Backcountry Shelter got in the way of plans for some, Park officials say it serves as a reminder for visitors to be more mindful. So what is aggressive behavior? Spokesperson Dana Sowen says it's bears that approach people or attempt to break into cars, tents, shelters or other structures in search of food and garbage. She says the young male bears at the backcountry shelter were doing just that. Park officials issued a bear warning, then trapped the bears and used aversive conditioning techniques. GPS callers say both moved outside the area since, but an incident Wednesday night with a third bear caused property damage and prompted officials to issue the closure. I think this time of year and in the early spring, you get some of that. Ed McAllister at River Sports Outfitters recommends his customers carry one small item at all times in case a bear begins to approach. If you look at it, see that? Every pack almost has a whistle on it. If you spot a bear, don't approach it. Slowly back away, increasing distance. If it approaches you, then use loud noise to deter it and move to higher ground. And there are also bear warnings out for trails, campsites, and a shelter where bears are currently active. That includes Gatlinburg Trail and Laurel Falls Trail. You can find a full list of those warnings on our website, WBIR.com. Robin, John. Amelia Young on the story. Thank you.